those people have no earthly idea whatsoever that when they consume whole grains, wheat, barley, rye, and oats, it has a dramatic negative impact on their body's ability to absorb essential nutrients. People have no idea whatsoever that when they eat fried food, they're ingesting acrylamide, which is carcinogenic and pro-inflammatory. And the more fried food that people eat, the greater their chances of getting cancer and an inflammatory disease. People are clueless about this. So they eat fried food all of the time. The best chefs in the world still cook with olive oil. This is a problem because, right, my people are destroyed by lack of knowledge. People have no idea that if you eat meat well done, the heterocyclic amines that are present in the meat will cause cancer and are pro-inflammatory. People shy away from eating meat that's rare. Oh, that's a health issue. Well, no, it's not. Well done red meat is a health issue. People have no idea that if they eat sausage, if they eat bacon, if they eat pepperoni, if they eat meats that have nitrates that have been injected into them, they will increase their chances of developing cancer from the nitrosamines that the nitrates turn into inside the human body. have no idea whatsoever. And so they continue to eat these things all of the time. People have no idea that if they consume a carbonated beverage during a meal, it's going to dramatically impact the state of the acid in the stomach. It's going to reduce, nullify, negate, neutralize the stomach acid so that now your body is unable to extract what little nutrients are present in the food to begin with. People have no idea. So they'll start a meal off with champagne or they'll... With their cheeseburger in paradise, they'll wash it down with a couple of beers. And this, of course, is the wrong way to go. You want to have a beer? No problem. Drink a gluten-free beer between meals. Do not drink anything that has bubbles in it during a meal because the bubbles contain carbon dioxide, and carbon dioxide neutralizes stomach acid. If you consume genetically modified corn, if you consume genetically modified soy, if you consume corn or soy that has been uh, sprayed with glyphosate, the herbicide Roundup, or planted in soil that glyphosate has been sprayed onto, then you're going to get bladder cancer, you're going to get kidney cancer, you're going to get thyroid cancer, something bad is going to happen. And it's been documented and proven. The World Health Organization even says don't eat this stuff. So it's not just the crazy nature paths on the hill.